In this presentation we're going to look at how to construct a simple scatter plot in SPSS. The version of SPSS we're using is version 19. The data set we're going to use is called iris.save. The variables are that we're going to use are petal length on the x-axis, petal width on the y-axis. So let's look at the data set here. This is the iris.save data set. We're going to use this variable and this variable in particular. Now, what we're going to do is go to graphs. Quite a lot of the time we go to analyze, and that might be a sort of gut reaction to go there in the first instance. But what we're going to do here is actually go to graphs. So we're going to click on chart builder, click on that. I'm just going to press OK in that, just have a quick read of that, just make sure everything is in order basically, that's what it says. So there we have it there. Now the first thing I do, we've got quite a few options down here, just down here in the bottom. So I'm going to do, uh, come up with a scatter plot. Now there's quite a, s a few options there, so I'll let you practice with those yourselves. I'm just going to sort of click, uh, click the simple scatter plot here in the top left. I'm going to click on that one. Now what I'm going to do is select the variables. So I'm going to have um, petal length on the x-axis and petal width on the y-axis. I'm just sort of changing it around from what I had there before. Now, um, there's a couple of, uh, there's this uh, menu bar over here, uh, or element properties, that comes up, but we're not actually going to use that this time, so I'm just going to sort of disregard that. So, uh, okay, we have everything we need, I'm going to click OK, and there we have it there. So, petal length, yeah, that's right, sorry, just checking, so we have uh, petal length and petal width. And that's our scatter plot. Now, what we could do there, there's a couple of options there to make a much more informative scatter plot um, that you can try out. But I'll let you. We'll do that in another presentation. Okay, that's it.